Hello and welcome to the Switch Underground. My name is Danny. Today we're gonna hop back on our wizard and see if we can knock out a few GRs. We don't have any of the Chantoto set yet, but we did uh, finish up the Veers set. So we have the Veers Amazing Arcana set with the full set bonus. And the follower, I just want to see if there's some good weapons for him. Um, I just ran the Ancient Puzzle Ring. My buddy in the comments here, K, I'm going to get this number right, K569, came through and joined a game I was in earlier this morning. And he uh, took me through the Ancient Puzzle Ring, dude. The, um, the Ancient Puzzle Vault, which is different than the normal one. It's kind of dark in there, and the enemies are a lot tougher. Of course, he was destroying everything in, like, one hit. And... It was like stacks and stacks of stuff, dude. It was really cool. So, let's see. Which rift do we want to do? So, I've been trying to farm stuff on T8, I think, is what I've been at. So, let's start the rifts down here. Or maybe it was like T6. Why don't we try a 30? Oh, that's really loud for me. Let's try a 30 and see how far we get and what we can do. I'm not really sure how it's going to work. So we're going to put up our armor and our magic weapon. Oh, and we're getting hurt already. And we're going to get out of the poop. And we're going to put up our Archon mode here. Try to move over to... Ooh, Conduit's good. So this is just going to allow us to like melt everything that we see, which is nice. And now we instantly go into starting to charge, charge up Archon again. And we're going to do that with our Obsidian Ring of the Zodiac, hopefully uh, be able to teleport around a little bit when that starts to pop up, but we got some baddies there. And we got to be careful. I'm going to grab that orb if I can. No, I can't. Archon mode is almost up. And we're going to hit it. Put up our little orby boy. Zap those guys. And I'm just, like, holding the explosion button, right? Because it just destroys everything. Hopefully, ooh, yeah, boss, we want that. Oh my god, dude. We just got so many orbs. That's amazing. And we're back into charge up mode again. Uh-oh. I don't know how close I really want to stand to those guys. I just want to get the hits in. Try not to get hit by that. And we remember, we do have our kind of oh poop button, right? So we can still take fatal damage and we'll be okay. But that only works every minute, so we gotta be careful still. Let's try not to die. Archon is almost back up. Okay, we're gonna try to find... Ooh, we're gonna try to find... Ah, this'll work. I was gonna say we're gonna try to find some big packs here. Oh, not get stuck in a tree. And the Archon has really good teleport that is up like all the time. Oh, I'm gonna kind of waste it here. That's still really loud for me. Okay, I'm gonna switch my volume a little bit. Just a minute. Ah, that's better. I can actually like hear my own thoughts. So one thing that's kind of tricky is my teleport button is a little different than in Archon mode. So I kind of got to switch my brain around a little bit when I'm in between the two. Which is fine. It's not a big deal. I also keep forgetting to cast the black holes, but thankfully they're all kind of casting automatically. So that's awesome. A little shield. And my Archon back up. Let's just turn it on. Looks like we probably got to go this way. Destroy those guys. And as we can see, things are going pretty well. Everything just kind of dies. So as soon as we get the Chantoto set, I mean, I don't know, dude. This is going to be crazy. And our new follower sword is pretty sweet, too. Uh, sky is really the limit. Are we going to get to 100? I don't know. I think I killed the boss there already. So we're just going to move on. 
try to find ourselves something good over here. Of course, it's a dead end. That's just how it goes. Where do we go wrong? Okay. I mean, a lot of places in life, but specifically in the game here. And that black hole. I'm going to try to always try to keep a black hole active if I can. Okay, my Archon is back up, but I'm in a wall here. I don't want to use it yet. And this room is kind of dying pretty easily, so let's just pop over here. But I think there is a boss in here somewhere. There he is. Start frying that guy. Got him. And we have almost popped the Rift Guardian. We're going to try to hold out for an Archon mode on the Rift Guardian. Just to make sure that he goes down easy. You never quite know what you're going to get. I think we're still at the stage of the game where we could be one-shot by something. Although, maybe not at this rift level. Okay, let's just stay right in this corner. We're just going to stay right away from that crap. I could really use my Archon mode right now. Thank you. Oh, man, that was a good one. Okay. Do I go down this way? I do. So we're going to try to teleport. So Archon Mode has several powers. One being this explodey bit, and the other is the beam. Then you have this little... little bubble here. I believe it slows down enemies and increases your uh, cold damage against them. But don't quote me on that one. I'm not sure. I'm sure you guys will know much more better than me. Let's just try to get our stuff back up here. Oh, there's a nasty group. Let's teleport. Black hole. Need to the black hole. And our Archon mode is going to be back up, and I think we're actually going to save it for the Guardian, which should pop pretty soon. Probably as soon as we clear this trash. There it is. So we're going to wait. We're going to pop a black hole first. Then we're going to pop it. And then we're just going to melt his face. Goodbye, Rhyme. Ooh, we got our Bane of the Trap, which means that we need to roll a socket on our Traveler's Pledge. I think we're just going to keep upgrading this guy, because we definitely want to use him. Our Black Hole uh, slows people, and I believe a lot of our stuff is suspected to ice, so a lot of... A lot of slowdown will be happening, even without the Bane of the Trap bonus, so we'll still be doing a lot more extra damage. Hopefully. So let's see, do we get any goodies? And I think I might have my bracers, but I need to check the little the link here. Hold on. Where is it? Let's see. Which bracers do I need? There it is. All right, gear and gems. I'm just looking at that link that I linked before. Uh, okay, so we want the... I think I have my bracers. Let's see. Yeah, these are the ones that I want to use. Um, I'm going to take a hit, but I do want that increase the potency of your shields thing. Probably not super important right now, but definitely will be later. And I think what I'll do is I'm going to re-roll that armor into critical hit damage. So we have our bracers, and I think the only thing left is the belt and the uh, Chantoto set, dude. So let's go, let's go melt all this stuff first. I'm not gonna want that, gonna want that. Nope. Uh, does my follower want any of that stuff? Probably not. Oh, we'll just salvage all this junk. Okay, strong arm. I have a million. Alright. Repair all of our stuff. Alright, so let's see. What can we roll for here? So the belt. Which belt do we need? Fazula's Improbable Chain. You automatically start with 45 Archon stacks. That seems really good. Let's try to get it. I can't afford that. And we can't afford that. 
it feels a little bad getting rid of a primal uh, string of ears, but hey, we do want to try to get the build as close as we can. So we'll upgrade this rare item and totally not get what we wanted. Lame. Just gonna salvage it all. All right. So that was the GR30 on the uh, Veers, not Chantota's wizard yet, but uh, soon. I want to re-roll this armor because I can get... Oh, I can't, but I can get cold skill damage. I thought maybe I could get uh, crit hit damage. Let's roll for the cold skill. Why not? This is going to be a 20. This is a 20. This one's a 20. Alright, we'll switch it up. We'll take some vitality. A little cold skill, maybe? Not what we wanted. But uh, my main thing is arcane, so we'll take that. Lightning skill, okay. We might have to roll with this arcane right now. Uh, life... Nah, we'll keep the damage. 16, that sucks, but we'll take it. Seven more tries, dude. Give us something good. Well, that is not better. Believe. Believe? Fire skill? If only... 18, okay, two more tries. Give us a 20. I'm gonna use all of them, dude. We've seen a 20 in every element except freaking cold. Not today. Maybe in the next one. Um, uh, let's see. What's the what's the next one? I kind of want to just do these in 10 since it's so kind of easy right now until it gets much harder. So what's 40? What's a GR40? 40 is T9. And then does it just jump up a torment level every 10? It does. Okay. I don't know, every 5. Damn. Alright, so we're going to try a 40 next time. And be good to each other. And I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.